Hi, my name is Kinsey Gibb, and I'm going to be doing the article um, abortion. Uh, first, please view the fetus. Okay, so first I'm going to do the facts. Um, the right to get an abortion has been in effect in the United States since 1973. Um, polls show that support for legal abortion uh, is declining. As a result, Oklahoma has passed several laws to limit abortion rights. Okay, so Oklahoma passed a law that um, states that women seeking to get an abortion need to get an ultrasound. Um, in addition to that, the doctor has to show them the um, monitor and point out the heart, organs, and lips. So Oklahoma is a pro-life state, and they really want to show these women what's inside of them, and when they know, they'll be less likely to abort um, their child. Oklahoma, therefore, is guilting the woman into having her child, which is no choice at all. The Oklahoma governor vetoed this bill but the legislator overrode him with large margins. So opponents would argue that even in the case of rape or incest, the mother would still have to view the fetus, which is cruel and unusual punishment. A second law was passed allowing doctors to not provide the information of whether or not the fetus uh, has birth defects. If a woman finds out that her fetus has birth defects, she'll be more inclined to abort the child, which, which is exactly what Oklahoma does not want. So according to the article, opponents argue that this bill is anti-abortion, it's anti-mom, it's anti-doctor, and it's anti-family. Okay, so as a result, Oklahoma um, agreed with the opposition and struck down both bills in 2000.